When I was thinking about where I wanted to go for residency, I wanted to match somewhere where I could get strong pediatric training, child development training, and also neurology training, both on the child and adult sides. IU really kind of fit the book for me. It's a program that gives balanced training in all of those areas. I went into child neurology because I knew I wanted to work with kids and um, I really like all the complex pathology and kind of thinking through problems involved in child neurology. And specifically, I liked IU because of the people. I've made some great friends here and just felt really warm during my interview and um, really connected with both the PEDS people and the child neurology residents and faculty. So I really value diversity and so the hospitals that we work at kind of pull from everywhere. So there's a wide variety of different types of patients, um, demographics wise, and then also like pathology wise too. Um, and then I also really, um, really enjoyed the acuity that I got to kind of hear from different people, um, the different types of patients that we saw. Child neurology is a subspecialty within the adult neurology training here. We're under the same umbrella as them. And so that means we're training side by side with really great adult neurology folks and the child neurology folks as well. And so that means also that the adult neurology folks get to train together with us at Riley Children's Hospital. The faculty here want to teach you. Um, they seek out opportunities to teach you even if it's in the middle of the night whenever you're um, talking with them over the phone, staffing patients. They also are happy to kind of be a curbside resource for you. So I've reviewed neuroimaging with some of my faculty members where I needed a little bit more help understanding what I was seeing. Riley, our children's hospital, is a major medical center and we get a really wide variety of the kinds of patients that we see. So um, I've seen anything from our well child visits during our pediatric years to autoimmune encephalitis in the hospital. And so Riley is the hospital for the entire state of Indiana, which means a population of 6.5 million people plus the people at the borders who come for first and second opinions, which means, you know, we see everything. We have a level four NICU, we uh, get to see urban and rural populations, we have a new maternity center, so we get to do things relating to prenatal counseling and care, neurology. I see a lot of patients, even though this is my first year technically of doing pediatric neurology, I see a wide breadth of patients, so anything from the bread and butter, like seizure kids, to the rare genetic disorders, I've seen it already and it's been like, what, four or five months then. So I think that's a good testament, again, to like the breadth of patients we see, but then also that faculty kind of trusts us to kind of get our feet wet, let us do our thing, and learn a lot. I've made some of my best friends here um, in the child neurology program. My co-residents are amazing. We meet up all the time and have dinner and we have wine nights where we uh, talk about our days and talk about our kind of wins and losses. And I mean, I couldn't ask for a better residency cohort. And then outside of residency, um, these are my friends. Uh, we go out to dinner, we um, go to events together. And I'm always happy to see um, those individuals, both on my mom and off service in the hospital.